The last two days of Sportsline Summer Camp have been in Iberville Parish. Stop number 16 is just one parish above. This December will make 10 years since Livonia won the state championship. In recent years, trophies and wins have been rare for the Wildcats. Now their new leader looks to change their misfortune. If there's one person who understands the area, obviously it's someone raised in said area. Example A is new Livonia head coach Khalil Thomas. After assistant coaching stints across the Baton Rouge area, Thomas returns to his Point Capi roots to try and bring back respect to the school he once knew. When Coach David Bruden used to be over there, that's kind of the times where me and my little cousins were growing up in New Roads. And so seeing, growing up with it at the top of the mountaintop and then just my cousins are there now and see, kind of hearing their experiences and then not necessarily being as competitive and kind of just feeling the pride of Point Capi had kind of dropped a little bit. And so it was an opportunity for me to come home. Thomas is one of the youngest coaches in the area at 28 years old, but his team messaging has had some old school tones. It's been a downtick. We understand that, but guys, they've had men from this area, men that grew up in the same neighborhoods, went to the same schools that were able to do this at a high level. They were able to kind of give the community something to rally around and be proud of. And so really my first message in, even to this day, has been, guys, we got to go take back our pride. We got to go restore our pride. We got a good bond with, uh, with our new head coach, Khalil Thomas. He's he a great coach. We really appreciate him coming to Livonia. We got close fast. He, he a real cool dude. Livonia is a class 4A program, but the recent numbers have been far from 4A. Now they're working with close to 50 kids, and one of the main differences this offseason has been the grind of 7-on-7. Seven seven. It is huge that we even got the opportunity to get out here. I was like, guys, we're not going to see these type of, these caliber of, of receivers, these caliber of DBs, these certain quarterbacks we face. You don't get to see those at practice in Livonia. So when we get to get on that bus and go compete against other schools, guys, you got to take advantage because we need to accelerate where we are as a team. It's a lot better uh, energy, just... Everybody coming out every day, putting in work. I feel great about the season, the upcoming season. It's going to be a lot better than last year. More on Livonia later tonight at 10. Liberty is on the 4th of July clock, literally. The Spruma closes out the weekday. All previews are on the WAFB website and YouTube page. In recent LSU news, six softball teams.